Well, you want to stay around, but that pier is all the way close to the house anyway. Well, I know that's right. That's maybe, maybe. that's one of the reasons I decided to come up here. They, usually there's a house money or two someplace. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry you can't hear this because they got. It. I, I'm hearing them, but uh, they're hooking on pretty good now. But I don't think they're running together. They got a rabbit yet, though? Yeah, yeah. They, they, they won't open if they don't smell it. Okay. Yours? Texas. It's only Texas, but when these things get in the middle of your rabbit race, you realize it's Texas. This is a nice uh, power line strip that comes into Andrew's house here, or his cabin, and he's got a, they got a deer cabin, and they got a cabin his mother used to live in. And, uh, but anyhow, this is the power line way down there. And I doubt if you can see it in this camera, they're cleaning underneath this thing. The reason this strip looks so nice, but this would make it nice for hunting. We can line this deal. They've been running a rabbit now. I would say I had watched my clock, but we're probably in order of 35, 40 minutes now. They've been running this rabbit off and on. They, and we keep waiting for it to come across the strip. And it hadn't, but it stayed, I think, well, a while ago it got closer, but it stayed, the hot part of the race has been, you know, 65 yards away from us up to about 120 yards out that way. And it's gone from over here in this corner to down here, you know, probably a couple hundred yards across. They're hammering it pretty good right now. We got six dogs on the ground. A while ago, they really were hot on it. And they ran it into this herd of cattle, which I think if I go around there and look, there's another strip on the other side of where those cattle are going back up through there. guys reading your geography books about the hill country of Texas, you're in it. Enjoy it. Andrew, he gets a direction so he, with his uh, Garmin, keeps track of where they are. Right now they're right out. He's kind of pointed at them right now. Okay. Pink collar, the catch one. Uh, oh, Carrie, Carrie, Carrie. Yeah. yeah, yeah. They're, they're going to do really well, aren't they? Yeah. They're not far across here now. They're... No. That's him. Yeah. That's Cash. Cows are all fat and fat and pretty, but they, uh, the way they're gathering up, they think we're here to feed them, I guess. Yeah, but I think they think we're here to feed them. Our race is kind of broke down for a second here. You notice if I was raising them, you know, the Black Creek cattle, I got black and white ones, you know. They make better burgers. These yearling steers. What have you? No, I don't, I'm sorry. It looks like you got some young heifers in this group.
There he is. Now they're going to get off your property, but they'll oh, be back. Yeah, but I, I wouldn't worry about it. They'll come back. This rabbit will come back, probably. So I think they're out in front of him. Yeah, they're out in front of him. They're out in front of him. Now, see, they hear that bark just then? He was barking at the cows again. Uh, uh, this is probably right close to the fence there. Yeah, they are. They're just barely into that cedar tree beyond the fence. Mm. But that rabbit may have been smart enough to cut through those cattle. And the dogs are going to have to decide. They'll go through. You can see the dogs out there working yeah. right out in front of the cattle. Yeah, I see them. Yeah. And the cattle definitely screwed things up, so... The dogs, it's going to take them a second to decide whether they're going to go behind the cattle or how they're going to. Okay, they're moving that way again now. Yeah. A little bit. No, that herd of cattle messed. Yard now. That herd of cattle messed that up for a second here. We'll yeah, see if we get around they it. They messed it up. There he is. Did you see him? Did you see him? Yeah. As my dogs hadn't worked around these cattle, and I think all of us, are, they're distracted a little bit by the cattle, but they should be coming out just any second. We just had the rabbit. Yeah, they're right there. Come up with. Yeah, they're right there. See them right there? Yeah. They ought to, if one of them hits it now, they'll take it right on across. to work towards us. There you go. They need to work in there tighter close towards us. Oh, that one's back barking yeah. at the cows. That's mine, I think, barking at the cow now. Guys, I just stood there and watched them cross. Well, we got these cows are chasing us around and they get in between us and the rabbit. And this time, I don't know, we haven't picked it up good and solid over here. We run it across the road, but we haven't got a hold of it over here yet. And I really didn't watch whether it went in or one of them was acting like it went down. No, there it is. There it is, Lace. There you go, girl.
I'm gonna check my watch here in a second. We must have a couple hours, or an hour, over an hour into this bunny. We saw the rabbit come through here, guys, and he went right down the edge of the house. So they're coming in from, they're coming in from the right, and they should get right behind where I started seeing him was right underneath that air conditioner, if you guys can tell what that is from here. He probably got there from under a car and everything else, but here they come. There's a porch there, and they got to figure out where he went around. He went through, under that porch, I think. Now, nah, Lace has got it. Lace has got it behind the porch. There they go. <laughs> There she is again. She's got it again. Actually, that was that was Cash just then. 